Hey, this is Brett, and this 2023 Jeep Wrangler Sahara 4xE is stock number 23J42. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Wrangler headquarters. Excited to show you this one today because it is one of our 4xE Saharas, and it is in hydro blue pearl coat, which is paint code PBJ. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video give you all the specs on this one. We're gonna check out the original window sticker, go inside, check out the interior options, and give you an idea of the um, just overall package on this one. This one is the 4xE, which gives you the two liter turbocharged four cylinder engine with the hybrid um, technology as well. Puts out 400 cents torque uh, when in hybrid mode. And it's gonna get you 49 miles per gallon equivalent it's also going to get you 20 miles per gallon on just the gas engine and has a total range of 370 miles. We'll get into it right away here. The high, um, the 4xE package gives you the Hydro Blue tow hooks. You also get the silver outlines around the fog light, headlamp, and grill bezels. Part of that Sahara package. This one has the LED lighting group, which gives you the LED headlamps, running lights, running lights around those headlights, and then the LED headlamps themselves. I'd highly recommend the LED lighting group on any Wrangler you get. This one also has the color matched fenders and the color matched top, which is a pretty expensive option as you'll see in just a little bit. The uh, Sahara package also comes with the 20 inch painted alloy rims and you get the Hydro Blue Jeep on there. And that's part of the um, 4 by e package, Bridgestone Dueler HL tires. And uh, these are 275, 55R20s, kind of a highway tread pattern to them. Couple little Easter eggs, you get these sandals in the shroud there. You also get the Jeep climbing up the side of the windshield. This one has the removable doors. You can see this a T50 on there. That's because this is a Torx wrench. 50 to get those hinges off. I actually did a video on how to take the doors off. If you want to check that out, that's in the upper right hand part of the screen. You also get the factory step bars on this one. Enter and go system. Here's the original window sticker. I'm not going to go through everything, but most of it. So the uh, 2023 Wrangler four door Sahara 4xE with the Hydra blue black interior, premium McKinley trimmed seats, two liter turbo, eight speed automatic transmission. Everything on the left here is your standard equipment, including the 8.4 with nav. And then your optional equipment starts right here with the Hydro Blue exterior paint, which is $4.95. The uh, 29P package is the Sahara 4xE package. Uh, this one has the cold weather group, which gives you heated seats, remote start, and heated steering wheel, as well as the leather wrap steering wheel. You also get the anti-spin rear differential or differential rear axle, which is $695. Now the three-piece color hardtop, like I said, is expensive package is $2,895. So to get that color match hardtop is like three grand. Side steps, 95 bucks. Jeep trail ready kit, which is 195. Total MSRP is 64,410. If you wanna get your summit price with all the rebates and incentives and availability on this Jeep, in the upper right-hand part of the screen is a video to our, or a link to our website uh, where you can check that out. Five years, 60, 100,000, or powertrain warranty. So you can see the warranties are a little different on these as, as opposed to the gas ones. Eight year, 100,000 mile hybrid system warranty and eight year, 100,000 mile high voltage battery warranty. And then three year, 36 bumper to bumper. So the uh, hybrid warranty is uh, substantially bigger and longer than the powertrain warranty. So that's just on the transmission and the gas engine. This is on the whole hybrid system. Um, and batteries. Here are your miles, fuel economy, and miles per gallon. Uh, so 49 miles per gallon equivalent is what the E stands for. And you can see you get up to 21 miles uh, just electric and uh, 370 total um, distance that you can go with gas and electric. And just the gas engine is 20 miles per gallon. So that's how to read that there and it takes about 2.4 hours to charge the batteries um, to get that 21 miles uh, of electric range 
um, on a 240 system and on a 120 system it's about 12 hours. So that's just about it with the original window sticker. We'll take a quick look at the back seats, four wheel disc brakes on the Wranglers. You get the LED tail lamps as well. Really enjoy the uh, color match hard top though. You also get the hydro blue um, tow hook. Get a better look at that tire tread. Back storage area comes with your soft or your hard top, your soft hard top bag. So this is for the front hard top pieces. This is for your charger, the case for that. This is your trail rated kit. This one does have the Alpine premium sound system. You get the color matched bars in here. To take this hard top off, there's three bolts on the left, two on the top, total of eight bolts. So three on each side and two on the top. And then uh, two quick disconnects. We actually did a video showing you how to take your hard top off of your JL Wrangler. If you want to check that out, it's in the upper right hand part of the screen. Very popular video. This is your charger for the hybrid vehicle. Comes with it. And then you get door hinge bolt holders as well as roof and windshield bolt holders. Note you get seven slots on the back door and the JL badge on the back for wheelbase overall length two door four door and water fording and yes you can water ford with the hybrid because all the batteries are sealed that's what they tell you on the website get the black fuel door and the enter and go system so you just have to have the key fob in your pocket the doors will unlock heated mirrors inside the Sahara package gives you that black leather interior, or the McKinley leather as they call it. You get the Sahara stitched into the backrest, the white stitching, or titanium stitching I guess they call it, on the seats. These seats do have a side airbags standard now, seat height adjuster and lumbar, auto headlamps, tilt telescopic steering wheel, and then you get the hybrid, electric, and e-save modes. So this is how you kind of control the hybrid system. Uh, we actually did a demo where we're driving around with all these different buttons on, but basically hybrid is putting it into gas and electric, so it decides on its own when it needs the hybrid system, when it needs the electric system to uh, get you the most miles per gallon. Um, and then this is just fully electric, so it turns off the engine, and uh, you're going to use that battery up uh, in 21 miles if you just have it on that mode. And then eSave basically turns off the electric and just uses the gas engine. So... Pretty cool stuff, check that video out. Locking doors, uh, power mirrors, the back seats. I wanna show these because they're a little different on the hybrids. You get the latch child safety system uh, for any child car seats. These headrests can fold down like so. So now on the normal Wranglers without the hybrid system, this back seat will just fold down and the whole seat will go into the floor. But on the hybrids, because this is where the batteries are located, this seat folds up and then this seat folds down. And what happens is you don't get a flat transition from the back storage area to this back seat. And that's the really biggest interior difference from the hybrid to the non-hybrid Wrangler. Uh, there is a 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in, two USBs, two USB-Cs. And uh, you get the factory floor mats back here as well. Child safety locks on the back doors. We'll hop inside, check out the instrument cluster and the radio real quick. I'm not going to go over it too much, but a little bit. And then we'll check out all those LED lights in just a second. So you get the 7-inch LCD display. Um, there's your battery life, also your range, your total range, battery and gas, average miles per gallon. Uh, you have your RPMs over here, and then you have your battery charge and uh, power percentage right there as well. So a lot of stuff going on on that instrument cluster it has the heated leather wrap steering wheel, cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left, and audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. This one has the 8.44C radio. You get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. You have your heated seats and heated steering wheel buttons, as well as your backup camera, which is HD, which I love that they've done on the Wranglers. Nice and crystal clear. Those Grid lines are dynamic as well, so as you turn that steering wheel, those turn as well, so that's pretty cool. And then you also have your factory navigation system. Um, there's Highway 41, 
and uh, we're right off Highway 41 if you want to come visit us. So this is your all your different apps. You have Projection Manager. We can project your cell phone to the screen. We actually did a demo with Android Auto. Um, if you want to check that out, that's in the upper right hand part of the screen. And then you have your off road pages. Those take a second to load. So while they're loading, I'll show you that it does have the volume, tune, and uh, climate controls, more tactile buttons and knobs, heated and seats and steering wheel button, stability control. This is your select speed control, screen off, mute. And then this button is your battery recharge. So if you want to recharge your battery more, press that button and you'll notice that the vehicle slows down a lot faster under. Um, no pedal, no gas pedal, uh, and that's what it's doing is it's recharging the batteries through the uh, regenerative braking system and it, it uses the vehicle's momentum to recharge those batteries. Um, so that's kind of a neat system, but you'll definitely notice it when you turn that light on. Uh, you have your window controls, a USB, USB-C. This one has the part-time four-wheel drive system and the four-wheel drive auto system, the eight-speed automatic transmission. You have your keyless entry with remote start. Uh, it does have the flipper key, which is one of my favorite key fobs of all time. And then uh, you get your off-road pages here. You got your steering angle, your transfer case, whether you're in two high or four high. You have your latitude, longitude, altitude, accessory gauges, and then your pitch and roll there as well. Uh, note that the dash is leather wrapped, so that's pretty cool. That comes on the Saharas. And then you have your quick disconnects for your front hard top pieces, SOS and assist buttons, auto dimming mirror, and your home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. So uh, we're going to check out all those LED lights. I did want to show you under the hood. Um, the other thing with the 4xE is this is where you charge it. There's a plug-in right there. That's where your charger goes right in. It'll click in, and then if it's charging, it'll flash green. If it's fully charged, it'll be full green. And if it's uh, got, it's not plugged in or something, something's not right, it'll be red. Um, so that's a pretty cool system right there as well. Like I said, I'll show you under the hood real quick. There's not a ton that's different under here. Um, basically just the power cord coming from the charger up there down to the hybrid system and to the batteries is really the only thing that is different under the hood. But I will show you the emission sticker so you can check that out. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to turn all the lights off in the studio. I'm gonna pause the video, turn the lights off, and then I'll show you the uh, vehicle with all the lights on in the dark so you can see just how nice those lights are. All right, you can see just how nice and bright all those LED lights are. Really looks good. They reflect nicely off that silver too. One of my favorite colors on the Wranglers with one of my favorite systems. I'm a big fan of the 4xE. It would definitely be perfect for my personal driving as I only drive about seven, eight miles a day. So it would be perfect to put it in that electric mode every day. Never use gas. Anyways, you can see those LED tail lamps, LED license plate lights, and just a really, really good looking Wrangler. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the video and I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video and hopefully from this HD video you've been able to get a really good idea of the overall looks, styling, options, understand a little bit more about the 4xE system and especially the Sahara package as well. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got to go to that website right there, summitauto.com, full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. Click the bell notifications, you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Automotive. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more Wrangler videos I've done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website, or how to take your hardtop off in the lower left, 
and a link to how to take your doors off in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this ultra clean, brand new 2023 Jeep Wrangler Sahara 4xE in Hydro Blue Pearl Coat. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember, like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.